um, you know, we, we mentioned it the other day with uh, with Dyson injuries are part of the game. Um, never like to see um, or want to see um, anyone um, get injured out there. Um, and, but like I said, but we'll have more information for you guys tomorrow, and just go by there, go from there. Can you talk about Daquan and what he brought tonight? Uh, Daquan was great. Uh, his energy, his effort. Um, communication. He plays with a level of physicality on uh, on both ends of the floor, um, so you feel his presence physically out there. Uh, just really good energy, sprinting the floor, um, crashing in, rebounding. Uh, you know, he, he played more post in college, but this level, he's he's a, he's a wing, and he has ability to, you know, get to the mid range and use his physicality to jump over guys, and did a great job for us, uh, providing energy off the bench. What did Trey play the whole game? I thought Trey did a really good job of letting the game come to him. Um, he, he drove when there were lanes. He shot the three with no hesitation. Uh, he playmaked uh, and made early easy passes. Um, when you play like that, it, it, it can look easy um, the way that he was playing because he, he, he let the game come to him. And um, he did a really good job just being effective and playing with a lot of energy. What's the plan for him tonight? Play more with that I, more than likely, that's it for them. Um, but we'll have those conversations um, and circle back to you guys tomorrow, obviously. But uh, more than likely, those guys are done the rest of the summer league. What did you think of what Tyreek did in the beginning to start? I, it, he made the most of his opportunity. Again, another person who uh, plays with a lot of physicality on both ends. Uh, Reek did a really good job, you know, offensive rebounds, setting screens, diving. And then defensively, he, um, he allows us to switch um, a lot, uh, you know, one through five. His ability to defend at the point of attack against smaller, quicker players. He has the athleticism and wingspan and um, the ability to recover if he is beat. Um, so, again, another person, all of our guys has played with a lot of really good energy, um, high motor, and um, very effective. Coach, the Pelicans are becoming known for being a team that develops that second round under Players. For a player like Daquan, what is are some of the keys to turning his way onto sticking around with the organization following summer league? Well, it's not just for us, but obviously it's for for everybody. You know, every time you step foot on the floor, you're auditioning, and for our organization and for 29 other teams, um, and you always want to put your best foot forward. So it's like what I tell anybody who's going for a job audition: um, handle yourself appropriately. And, you know, he's a worker, play with a level of intensity and physicality, and um, you'll stand out. And he did that tonight. Brandon Ingram kind of uh, bombed uh, Trey Murphy's interview at the end there. Did he? He didn't play any defense. However, the team looked pretty good. What is your, your thoughts on the defensive effort? Uh, he got beat a couple times off the dribble. Um, having said that, uh, I think all of our guys did a really good job flying around with our rotations. And I think a, a lot of that is uh, big brother, little brother stuff, <laughs> but uh, uh, speaks to the uh, camaraderie and the chemistry that um, those guys have um, as a unit. What did you think of the, the difference in the passing? It seemed like the passing was a lot better tonight. Yeah, I mean, we, we showed him film. We talked about it a lot, going paint to great, and uh, just playing point five basketball. And there were a couple times we kind of put our head down a little bit too much, uh, trying to get to the rim. Uh, you want to get to the rim, obviously, to collapse the defense, but then you just got to make the next best play, whatever that is. If it's an opportunity to finish, that's great. But with, when you get to the paint and that defense collapses, there's usually kick out and scoring opportunities. Um, and we did that much better job of just playing .5 basketball, playing our, our, our brand of basketball.